can go in that train. Probably some good stuff in there. Whoa. Damn it, I'm telling you. What kind of people would spend their days in a thing like this? Can I take out the mama? Maybe. You know, I've got a flush down when do this. I probably should have mind controlled that one. I'm annoyed. It stops saying what level people are. Ooh, I can get chain lightning now.
see where this takes me. Ooh, yeah, I'm definitely gonna have to level up some more. Alright, so after I explore this area, I think I'm going to have to clear out the Iron Serpent and clear out the scrapyards before I can progress. This looks like the perfect place to find something cool. So I think I'm getting better. Look to the big central building. Looks like someone's in trouble. Oh. Looks like we're not the only mutants around here. She looks trapped by those machines. We should help her. Thanks for the help. Not that I needed help. I was just getting my second wind, you know, but I admire your fighting skills. You need skills like that in the zone. Especially against air control machines that want to quarantine you. Whatever that means. Your skills are top notch. Surviving out here on your own. That's brave. What's your name? The name's Farrow. Don't ask me where I got it from. I don't quite know, really. I was raised in a settlement. Thought it was the only settlement left on the whole wide world. But meeting you lot makes me feel a bit more, well, hopeful. Who are you? What are you doing out here? None your business. We're stalkers from the Ark. We're headed south to rescue our friend from some lunatics called the Nova Sect. Heard of them? You're asking me if I've heard of the Nova Sect? Mate, the Nova Sect butchered my bleeding settlement. They put their mind control junk into the rest and led them away like cattle. I'm the only one that got away. So yeah, I know the Nova Sect. I'm hunting them. I'm gonna make them pay. Cool. You'd be the perfect addition to our crew. If you help us save our friend, we'll help you take down the Nova Sect. Wh why are we making that offer? Like, I mean, she seems just like you know, dead set on killing the Nova Sect, and that's gonna happen anyway, because, I mean, we are killing Nova Sect we run into. We could just tell her that. We don't have to promise that we'll stop all the Nova Sect. Ooh. The young subjects are developing faster than we could have imagined. During our journey to the facility, we encountered a squad of rogue enforcers which began firing upon us. The subjects dealt with them effortlessly. The youngsters have exceeded my wildest dreams. If only Central Command wasn't so narrow-minded, the Earth could once again be ours. That sounds a lot like the, um... Ancient, no, not ancient one, the elder one. You know, in his words, he discovered them in the when they discovered the ark. I wonder what this Sounds might like hold. Sounds like bullshit to me. Ooh, nice. Like if I didn't know any better, these mutants are a creation of the el elder one. And he's been telling porkies the whole time. He's been lying to them so they do whatever he says. Or just to make himself seem more important. Either way. Dark secrets. Shall wonder. What weapons they she got? Ah, boomstick. Can't have time for a stuff. Alright, let's see what the other mutations are. Circuit breaker. Snip breaker. It's pretty good. I'm gonna go for that. That seems more unique. Like, and I quite like this idea of, like, you know, developing... Like, you know, rotating my people for different squads. I mean, different situations. That's pretty good.
Oh wait, I can see the longer now. That's good. You know, actually, I'm going to call this a short episode, but I'm just going to try and get to the end of this cave and end there. This will probably be one of the shortest episodes I've done, but you know what? I have done a few long ones. Well, they don't come out long, but there's a lot of editing involved. We're almost there. Beyond this farm is the Novasec base. That's probably where they're holding your friend Hammond. If you want adventure, you're about to get it. Okay, this was a... Ooh, jeez. You know, I'm just going to do this like it's a clean-up episode sort of thing. I don't know, just nitpicky stuff. Part of the reason I'm doing this is because I'm aware, like, there are going to be reasons why I'm not going to be able to record sometimes in the near future, and also it's going to be difficult to edit and such, so... Just want to have something for the schedule. Rather than leaving a break, I'd rather just, you know, have something small to release just to keep it going for continuity's sake. A few people from our settlement came this far south once. They just didn't come back. Some say their bodies were turned into plants and eaten by evil wizards. This place gives me the creeps. Jeez, what a creepy name for a place, the cult lands. Why would you ever go to a place called that? Still, let's see if the Elder has anything to say about his little journal. Oh, it looks like we're going straight to him. Your search for Hammond opens your eyes to an undiscovered country, huh? Wondering if paradise lies beyond the zone. Enclaves filled with happy people. The enclaves are the best and brightest all destroyed themselves. They were only human. What else could they do? The restlessness and rage of the outside world slowly seeped into their hermetically sealed utopias. And soon they were all at war. They all killed each other. For what? Why would they do such a thing? I don't know. Maybe they were bored. There is no paradise beyond the zone. Don't go looking for it. Your home is here. You're a lunatic. Like, I said that from the beginning, but... Okay, I'm guessing he... Okay, so he must have been a scientist of some kind, because it had doctor on it. So I'm guessing the mutants are something he created as a way of exerting control of them. He's created this paternal bond with them as if to say, you know, I'm, you know, we found you in this natural state rather than I'm your creator, I'm your adoptive father, which I suppose sells better. Question is, did he have some to do with those enclaves falling apart or is he just opportunistic and just trying to keep his own little slice of paradise in his own idea. Farewell. Remember your elder's guidance. Hmm. Is that something about reclaiming the world that the government wants so narrow-minded? I wonder if he still wants to do that or if he's given up on those goals and he just wants his own portion of land separate from whoever he used to answer to. I hope we get answers to these questions, actually, because I'm very intrigued. I was a stalker for 20 years. Spent quite some time out there. 
One night we were south of the Ark on patrol. We went inside an ancient building that was filled. Oh gosh, I think I didn't spend anything. Alright, I've already got a pipe gun, so I don't need another. What I desperately need is a silencer. Safe travels. Well, look what the zone wolf dragged in. Good to see you. Have a swell time out there. Someone told me they saw a machine that walks on two legs out there. Looks like a metal man, they say. Hey, I'm not... Hmm. I'm gonna hold fire. Take it easy. So, um, I hope you've enjoyed. I was not gonna say fuck, I promise. But yeah, so thank you for watching, I hope you enjoyed. Please like, favorite, or subscribe if you have, and be sure to check out my mixer, I'm also doing that now. Just, like, I mean, that's less planned, that's not really a series, that's just more, I, like, each time I do it, I pick a game I feel like playing for a bit, and just that, it doesn't have any structure, it's a bit more just loose. But anyway, thanks again, and have a great day, goodbye.